Hi. Hi there. How you guys doing? <clears throat> Good. How are you? <laughs> I was talking to the subscribers. Oh, hi. <laughs> <sighs> I'm just trying to be funny. It is a gorgeous evening. Is it still afternoon, technically? Yeah, it's the borderline. It's the borderline time between afternoon and evening. I don't know if that's the name. But yeah, that's it's the called time. fabulous. Yeah, it's very nice <laughs> here. It's very uh, comfortably warm and uh, sunny. Mm -hmm. So we're just kind of chilling out in our our backyard and our garden. Our garden, and we we had dinner, and uh, yeah, we're just uh, talking about you guys and thinking about our lives. And I'm looking at my daughter make faces at us. <laughs> And she's being a goofball. What a ham. She knows we're filming. And so... She's, Stop! She's totally distracting us here. And uh... She's like hiding but, under the window and like slowly popping up. So... Yeah, so we're just... This is one of those kind of days. We're just kind of taking it easy and having fun. I have today off. Uh, took an extra vacation day. <laughs> I'm sorry. I should look away. <laughs> okay, I so, promise I won't look anymore. No, it's. I can't help but funny. I'm like a child. So um. What now? Yeah, extra day off. Just chilling. Yeah, thinking about you guys. Yeah, so we're thinking about you guys, and we're thinking about things that we could talk about and share. And one of the things that uh, we've been having to do a lot lately, and I must say from the outset that that I'm not always particularly good at but I feel like it's a skill that I am working on and need to work on and uh, is uh, kind of the, there's probably multiple names for it and we're not going to get too technical <laughs> but just the, the art or science of reframing things uh, when it comes to our perspectives and the way we look at stuff uh, and an example would be you know you know like when we're living our lives and we're doing what we can when we can or not doing much at that particular moment because we, we're unable to uh, sometimes, you know, things, tasks build up, things kind of get left behind, and if uh, Lewis wants to scroll to the yard, you, should, you can see my, my, my lawn here. Is, is growing. <laughs> I'm growing, I'm growing lots of uh, grass and weeds and 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 whatnot and I've I've had some. I don't like this angle. <clears throat> Sorry, y'all. I've had some additional. I've had some additional uh, problems with uh, my upper body recently, last few months and and uh, um, and so uh, yeah, it's it's been a little bit of a challenge for me to do some of the yard work and whatnot and so plus we've just been crazy busy. And so um, my reframe in, in when it comes to my, my yard is I'm enjoying the longer <laughs> grass and the longer weeds. No, really, I'm actually, not. Actually, <laughs> actually, I'm not. I'm not because, it, <laughs> wait a minute, I'm supposed to be all like, yay, positivity. But yeah, no. It's fresh. I almost want to take a pair of scissors out here because all of my cute little pots are starting to be overgrown by weeds and grass and I'm like dang it I can't this, even see the cuteness of my yard right this now this is cute for me to get off my butt and no you've got it, your own health issues so but no for me but, it comes down to content like I just have to be content with it it is what it is right now and that's yeah. something I say a lot um that was just one example I mean yeah. it's some things are easier to reframe than others actually you know the grass growing is a little bit of a pet peeve what about if you're being you're but, late somewhere yeah, that's a tough one too because we don't like being really, late. We, and, and, I hate being late. And we get stressed, but we've been finding ourselves running late more often because it just takes longer to get ready. Uh, so, what does that look like when it plays out in reality? Well, usually, usually hits on some of those stress responses, those triggers, you know, of like. It's one of know. my biggest triggers. It turned like psycho. And so, but she's been working on that. I and, mean, and, and what I mean by that is I just get like super stressed out. Like, if there's any kind of time table that we're supposed to be somewhere by a certain time it just triggers me to be like really stressed and anxious um but i've been doing a lot of mental reframing like it is what it is um we are going to get there exactly when we ought to um we're doing our best that we can um there's nothing that we can do about it this time you know we can make better choices next time if it's something that maybe was poor time management because we like to talk to each other and 
we often get sidetracked. And yeah. Late. Or yeah, it's or not just, just that. I mean, that's... Just, things, just lately things actually are taking longer. Well, no. See, that's what I mean. It used to be that we could get sidetracked and talk and then still be everything fine. And it's like, but now yeah. with my health and you being run down with your own health and taking care of me, it's like everything just takes so much longer. And then yeah. you're realizing, oh, we really needed way more hours than we thought. Yeah, you know? we're not running... We're not necessarily running and getting up and getting out the door, you know, real quick. So... Uh, at this season in our life so yeah just you know these these changes and things have happened and so we're trying to reframe some of these things I'm gonna be quite honest with you it's not always pleasant you know I don't enjoy my grass my yard being longer and so forth and uh, I'm trying to shrink I, my head because I, <laughs> I, look, I look so big there if I if I think about it too much you know it'll bother me but you know so probably it's just you know realizing you know we'll get something worked out or I'll get it done when it's supposed to be and um, and just uh, not letting it stress but it depends what the topic is. Some topics are harder to deal do that with than others. But those are a couple of the things we've been dealing with, you know, just like, you know, how, around the house maintenance issues, you know, chores, things like that. Um, we have a big pile of laundry that's, you know, all the laundry in the house is clean. But there's a rather really large pile. Really good at that part. And, 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 and it's very daunting when you look at it, you know. It looks rather large. But I'm trying something new. I, we'll see how it works. But, you know, I'm trying things in small increments. So, you know, I went in there today and I folded laundry for about 10, 15 minutes got some piles going and uh getting them sorted and organized and and there's a lot more of that to do but you know we're figuring we're going to kind of chip away maybe at that we should actually bit. finish those putting whatever you folded it away yeah because then it's like you actually made a difference sure because really you just reshaped the pile no well, offense i mean i appreciate it if you want to be technical Ow! to me to me it looks hopeful excuse me henry when he does not want to be out here anymore you little stinker. He comes up and literally bites you. Such a bad boy. Such a bad kitty. Can you guys see him? <laughs> you see him? Bad, bad kitty. <clears throat> you probably couldn't even have seen him. It was probably the grass. Does anybody want to trade cats? I'm a terrible vlogger. <laughs> Here, look at my cat. I didn't see it. I just saw your weeds. Oh, okay, sorry. He's lost. He's lost. It's not that long. Okay, even really your isn't. chair up with mine, because you make you look like you have a shrunken head, or I look like I have a gigantor head. Do you want me to hold the camera? No. All right. Also, what else did you do today besides laundry? That was pretty miraculous. Then what? Yeah, um, I uh, I cooked some burgers, and uh, I'm not a cook. I don't know if you know this or not, but I've had the great fortune of marrying a wife that, that cooks well <laughs> and, and enjoys it, and um, I haven't, I haven't, uh, um, been in a situation where I've, I've cooked a whole lot. I've done a couple things here and there in the past, but just very minimal. Really? This is before we're married. <laughs> <laughs> Cause you were just trying to say so, that you haven't cooked a whole lot. No, no. It's, I'm trying, I think I could probably count on one hand. <laughs> I'm trying not to paint and the picture. And it's usually as, if I had the death flu or something. <laughs> I'm trying not to paint the picture as sad as it is. <laughs> I'm reframing here. <laughs> So, so, uh, but yeah, so I'm, I'm trying to, to, you know. So we stood there and I, I just told him what to do yeah. today. And, and the burgers sound really great. Everybody loved them. So, you know, it's kind no of fun. No buns. And, uh, so just trying to, you know, uh, shift, uh, some, some of the, uh, things a little bit, change things up and, uh, you know, work on tasks and, and try to, you know, ease burdens and, and, and things like that. And so. I think one thing our friend Natalie, who's come over and <clears throat> helped us, one thing with reframing she really helped is that when she was over, I realized how often that, and I think I may have told you guys this before, but how often I would like pick something up and go set it somewhere near and be like, okay, I'm, I'm going to do this thing later and I'll set all these things out so I can visually see what needs to be done, but never actually do those things. And so I have all these started things that I'm going to do. <clears throat> and she helped me realize how frequently I do that. And if I just followed through with that task one at a time that um it's more successful and it's really helped a huge yeah i've been trying to practice that a little bit too so like if I, i'm thinking about doing something so i'm just thinking about it i just go do it I or i get water. i get started and i then i i finish it um and uh so i just i make sure i don't start big things you know I, i'm sorry i'm not gonna you know i'm not gonna paint the house <laughs> you know <laughs> or you know fix the car I'm glad or whatever you decided yeah, you know, because that was on my list. Yeah. You know, I'm not going to re-roof the house or anything like that, so. So, yeah, reframing. 
Do you guys practice reframing or positive thinking or, you know, just trying to <clears throat> look at things as like the glass is half full? What yeah. do you do? Yeah, what do you Leave do? Leave us um, a message in the comments telling us um, like your favorite reframing that you're practicing right now. Yeah, what, 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 or what do you find that, that helps you to kind of get through the day and, and the challenges and the changes that, that you deal with? Uh, but what helps you kind of navigate through that successfully? Because, you know, we need to kind of stay, you know, we try to kind of stay up, you know, upbeat, up, you know, and, and enjoy our lives as much as we can still. And, uh, you know, and, and not be, you know, there's enough overwhelming things with health issues to let alone <clears throat> let our rest of our lives become overwhelming. Yeah true so okay yeah guess uh, what if you like the video give it a thumbs, thumbs up. up or and or subscribe if no you no haven't. and or well in addition you... to liking the video subscribe hit the little subscription button and then the little bell if you want to be alerted when we do um put out a video and yeah yeah that's about all Totally. Right. Totally. We're going to enjoy our evening. We're going to yeah. have some strawberry shortcake now. And I really want my fizzy water and I lost it. And uh, yeah, we're looking forward to hearing from you guys. I really want to hear what, what tips and stuff that you guys are working with. And, yes. Uh, we want to, we want to steal them from you so we can no. be even better reframers in our own daily lives. Yes, we want to Oh, learn. not to like be, you know, make money off of you and make greeting cards with your great ideas or something. No. <laughs> No, but just, just, just we, to, uh, to, we, we, you can never have too many reframings. Okay, we've got a kid making faces at us again, so it's our cue to go for reals this time. All right. Bye. Talk to you soon.